girl is unique back again and today I want to talk to you about this ratchet stripper turned comedian turned fucking hip hop artist Cinderella the infamous Cardi B Shorty went from being a roach to a butterfly and before you get your little panties in a fucking bunch But I just want to say thank you everybody that has seen me blossom into a butterfly You know what I'm saying? I went from a roach to a butterfly Exactly, it came from her mouth directly before I get into why Cardi B is winning as fuck right now you need to click that subscribe button down below because I'll be spilling some tea. I got story times. I got pranks. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. I talk a lot of shit too. And um, stay tuned to my shit talking, alright? Now let's get into why Cardi B is fucking winning. She is winning as fuck right now. Go shorty. It's your birthday. You hit number one on the billboards. Yo, everybody is so proud of you. The hood is so proud of you. Like, Cardi B's fan and followers love her to death. To fucking death. Because she is the freakless out here. There are five reasons why Cardi B is winning as fuck right now. And I'm just about to get into it, alright? So, number one. The reason why Cardi B is winning is because she is funny as fuck. As fuck. So, you know what I'm saying? You know, I gave my father... A Father's Day gift, you know, a couple of weeks ago and everything for Father's Day. Then this nigga gonna ask me for another gift today for Dominicans for the day. And it's just like, um, did you make me once or did you make me twice? Ah, okay. Ah. It all started because she was posting these videos of her just sitting in her room talking shit. And I'm talking about the talking the realest shit ever. Like, she is so funny. And the craziest thing is that she's not even trying. She doesn't sit there and think of jokes to just go on Instagram and talk about. This is real shit that she done cooked up in her crazy little fucking head. And she's like, I'ma just talk about it because ain't nobody else saying it. And that shit is ratchet and it's funny and we fucking love it. I'm sitting on a guy's face, right? And he was doing such a good job. Girl, I got carried away and I put my whole weight on him. Bitch, I broke his nose. We had to go to the hospital and say somebody jumped him. <laughs> <laughs> like, I can go on her page all day and crack up at every goddamn video. And you go ahead and you do that and you tell me that you aren't laughing. Tell me that you don't find her funny. <laughs> mm -hmm, exactly. Number two, as to why Cardi B is winning as fuck right now. She is pretty as fuck. That bitch can pull off any fucking wig. She can pull off any fucking color. She can pull off any fucking outfit. She's pretty. Her body is lit. And it just, it is what it is. Like, she can, she can rock anything and kill it. Let's talk about fashion week in New York City. Lord, she gave me life. She gave me life. This fucking black shiny dress. She kills it. She kills it. And now let's talk about the Rihanna event. And she came in that beautiful, that Cinderella Bella blue dress. Mm. Girl, I'm not a lesbian, but I will tear your ass up. She is just so pretty. She's catchy. She's, she's fucking eye candy. So that's another reason why she's winning. She's not only funny, but she's pretty. So she caters to men and she caters to women because witches love looking at a pretty bitch. For real. Number three, as to why Cardi B is winning as fuck right now. She is raw as fuck. Fuck, and I'm talking about the rawest fucking meat you could ever fucking possibly get on a platter. Like, this bitch will say whatever's coming to her mind. Like, now, because she's blowing up a little bit more, and she's looked at much more as a role model, and she's very smart. So now, she's thinking before she speaks. But the reason why we fell in love with her is because Shorty says whatever is on her mind, whether you like it or you don't. And... That's just, it is what it is. She does not care whether you like it or whether you don't like it. She's going to speak what's on her mind because that's her feelings at the point in time. And 
and that's why we love her like we fucks with you because we all want to do that we all want to speak our mind we all can look up to somebody that does not care how people think about them that just says what's on their mind because that's how they're feeling we love that shit and it's funny because i actually was supposed to be on love and hip-hop new york with her yeah, I know. Go figure. And I'm not going to disclose what my role was supposed to be. It was the first season that she was on there. And I'm not going to disclose anything else. But just know that if I would have met you on Love & Hip Hop Girl, like, we probably wouldn't have been friends. Because you was kind of ratchet back then. And I would have had to get ratchet to and out of character. And, you know, when I do see you, Cardi, like, we going to be fucking friends. Like, I'm just saying because I'm so fucking proud of you. And... I just know that shit would have turned out ugly if I met you on there. And everything happens for a reason. I didn't get on the show. You did. You got blown the fuck up. And bitches is happy for you. Woo! Don't ask me no more about why I wasn't on Love & Hip Hop. Because I do not. Um, I'm not going to use the word slander. Because the shit that I would say is true. I never lie about nothing. But I'm just not going to talk about people that I don't fuck with no more. Okay? Mm. A girl had beef with me. She going to have beef with me. Forever. Forever. Now let's get into number four. The fourth reason why Cardi B is winning as fuck right now is because this bitch is so humble. I be going to so, to so many different places and I be getting this love and I be like, I can't believe people from here even love me. Like that shit is crazy. Like, and it be different type of people. Like it be Spanish, black, white, Asian, uh, Arabian people, all types of people, you name it. Yes, she is so humble and the hood fucks with it. Normal people love that because she is relatable, okay? So there's never been a time that you can say people saw her and she gave them the ill face. This bitch is so grateful. She's over there thanking J. Cole, she's thanking Rihanna, everybody she meets. She is gratefully and genuinely, you can feel, you can feel how her heart is absorbing and is so grateful and appreciative of everything that's going on in her life right now and we all can feel it too and that's why people are so happy for her we are here to support you bitch because you understood that you came from being a stripper you didn't really have that much to work with and you worked your way up and you worked hard and you fucking deserve it because you appreciate it you ain't one of these people that's just like yeah i deserve it because i work fucking hard like you understand you can't even believe it so that's why we fuck with you cardi because you're the one that really shows your appreciation and that makes us so happy for you so so happy for you this other artist out here and apparently this one artist that dissed her aka Nicki Minaj now don't get me wrong I love my bitch Nicki like I fucking love her and I love her because I love her music I also love her rawness because she's raw and gangster and hood and pretty as fuck too but when I say I don't know if she's that humble, you know, I don't know her personally. I know people that know her personally and of course they will never say a bad thing about her because they're like this with her. And that's all good and dandy, but my personal experience when I met Nicki Minaj, it was not that good. I did a music video for Big Sean, the ass 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 video, and my face wasn't really in it. It was just like girls and like their silhouette and um... I think we was holding like a bottle of Grey Goose or whatever. Nicki Minaj just finished filming her set of the video in a different room. So it was time for her to leave and in the area that we was filming, she had to walk past our area. There was glass doors and she walked past to get to the elevators. So she walks and she stands there and she's looking through the glass doors. And one girl is on set but everybody kind of like turns around because it's not just little ass, pretty ass Nicki Minaj. It's a fucking entourage, okay? So we notice these big ass guys in black and we're like what's going on so we look and we see nikki and yo bitch got so excited and i'm telling you i'm a little groupie for some bomb ass bitches okay and i love me some nikki minaj i knew her when her mixtapes came out and i was like yo oh my god nikki's right there right there like i don't want to say like groupie like what do i do our other girls was turning around looking and looking so i turned around and i started looking and i was looking at the other girls and one girl actually like waved to her nikki made the craziest fucking stank face that she could ever make and turned around and walked away 
and it was just like damn bitch like we filming for you like we didn't ask for a hug we didn't ask for an autograph we didn't ask to say hi and run up to you the bitch just waved like you could have fucking cracked the goddamn smile i don't give a fuck how angry or how tired or if you have a headache it doesn't matter like you watching us you know, like, even we doing something for you, no, we nobody, but we respect you, and clearly we're your fan to fucking wave at you, because that's some groupy shit, like, no bitch is just gonna randomly wave at another bitch that they don't know, like, appreciate it, okay, so that's another reason why people love Cardi, because people show love to Cardi, that bitch shows it right back, right back. Back. So shout out to you Cardi, continue being humble as fuck, which I don't think that's going anywhere And you will continue to get love and praise that you deserve, bitch And I love you motherfuckers and thank you for loving me and supporting me So the last fifth and final reason that I have came up with as to why Cardi B is winning as fuck right now Is because she hustles as fuck Cardi B is the definition of a female hustler Yes, and I'm not talking about drugs. I'm talking about that bitch works hard. If you listen to Cardi B's interviews, she talks about how she was kicked out of her house, how she had to find a job, how she went to school. She had to drop out of school because she needed to work to support herself. So shout out to you, mama, because I'm the same way. When I need money, a bitch does whatever the fuck she gotta do to get some money, to put a roof over her head, to put some food in her goddamn stomach. Like, I will not suffer i will not starve because i'm gonna do what i gotta do and she is the same way she went to the strip club she started stripping because that was her in her mind that was her only option i'm i'm sure that if cardi b found other ways to make money she would have done it but she needed money quick assumingly right so she went to the strip club she became a stripper and with that she started making her comedy videos and with that she started hosting and with that she fucking made music and she made connects she met plugs she got on love and hip-hop and it has just never stopped from there she continues to work hard she is very very busy if you keep up with her and you listen to her interviews she tells you i've been here i have no time for myself i don't have time to sit down girl i don't even know how you dating right now but keep it up because you are doing your fucking thing it seems like cardi is performing every single day she's doing interviews she's making appearances this bitch works hard and clearly she's paying her mama bills so she gotta do what she gotta do keep up the good work cardi those are my five reasons as to why cardi b is winning as fuck right now because shorty you the fucking bomb congratulations again on making number one for billboard's top 100 Girl, like, just keep it up. We are so proud of you. Why do you fuck with Cardi B? Why do you love Cardi B? Leave your comments below. I'd love to know why everybody loves and fucks and supports with Cardi B right now. Shout out to Cardi B. It's Barty Gang, bitches. Subscribe to your girl, Lisa Unique's channel. And um, I'll talk to you soon, lovies. Bye. Looking like a quarter lick. lick. Run up for me, you get hit. And know my bitches with the shit. Yeah. Don't New York, case a bitch.